Well, hello, Scorpios and Capricorns. Welcome to your love reading. All right. Well, right now, well, this is what we're going to do with your love reading. We'll get Oracle cards. Spirit giving you two of those. All right, we're looking for Capricorn and Scorpio. Thank you, Spirit. All right, so we have our Oracle cards. Then we're going to go on next to our reading. Now, the reading is going to be seven cards. Thank you. Thank you, Spirit. Oh, they got a lot to say about you guys. Okay, that's five. Thank you, Spirit. And the Vice card, please. Thank you. All right. Wow. Are you guys, like, really turned up? Or one of you are really, like, anxious? That's what I'm hearing. All right, before we go any further, we must take care of our business. Please give us a like and a share, okay? Share this with others, all right? And also, don't forget to subscribe. That button is right there on the right. It looks just like our logo, all right? That'll help us out, and it also will notify you when I do your monthly love reading, your monthly for Scorpio and Capricorn and Mint Month, okay? So, now we're going to get started here. We're going to do the tarot cards first, and then we're going to do our Oracle cards. Now, the energy of your relationship this month. You guys are making plans. I hear some of you are is goal plans. Other of you is vacation plans. How are you guys feeling right now? Uh oh. Either someone is 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 living in fear that someone's going to walk away. That's what I'm hearing. Okay, Capricorns. I'm hearing this is going more your way. All right. Now the foundation of the relationship. Y'all should be enjoying yourself, kick back, going with the flow, because your relationship is working right now. All right? That's your foundation and your connection. Wow. There's a lot of passion. A lot of passion and, 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 and um, neutral would want to be together. So you go, you're working for it. You're working for it. All right? Where you guys are headed. Mm. All right? Don't overthink this relationship, okay? Do not. See, I think that's where this is coming in, this buying right here. Do not overthink it. Go with the flow this month, all right? Okay, your near future. Yeah, you should be concentrating on your goals, but you're going to realize that towards the end of the month and the beginning of November, all right? And your advice, I've told you. Do not overthink this relationship, all right? Now, we're going to clarify our cards. The three of creation, okay? Yeah, see, you guys are making your goals, even your, your relationship goals. I see you guys are, 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 are making more dates with each other okay so that's the main your if that's not your main goal right now that's this should be your main goal right now is for you guys to be dating even if you are married already you should be still dating especially this month okay now how you guys are somebody yeah somebody is feeling strongly about about working walking away from this relationship yeah see but the thing is you coming back see <laughs> you coming back if you are the one um I'm, I'm here more of the Capricorn uh yeah because you, you 
This is where you, your passion lies. This is where where you feel more at home. Okay, so um, spirit saying if you if you really thinking about about walking away, please uh, rethink it. Yeah. Okay, rethink it. Choice is yours, but they want you to rethink it. Okay. Now. The foundation. Yeah, you guys have a very strong foundation. Uh, money is no problem. <clears throat> if you're married, I see money is no problem. There's a lot of love in, in this relationship. You guys stick to your plan. You stick to... Mm, see? Strong love. If you stick to your plan, everything is, is uh, as far as your money situation is everything is going to work out but you have to stay focused stay staying focused okay now where y'all headed mm, i do see a lot of passion i do see a lot of happiness but i also see in somebody <clears throat> is one of you guys are overthinking it and and they telling you to go with the flow this month okay look Go with the flow this month. Do some dating. All right. Capricorn, don't work so hard. You need to concentrate a little bit on your relationship. Okay. This month. Yeah. Okay. Because this walking away is still coming up. And this power is saying you're going to have to change things. Look. This could be your twin flame. All right. <clears throat> now, where you guys are heading? See, this overthinking, this overthinking, this. Mm. But they saying you are going to come to the conclusion is you guys are soulmates. Capricorn, I'm here and this is you. Yeah. But you think it's it's too hard, but where there's a will, there's a way, Capricorn. All right. Okay, this is your near future. Like I said, I don't I don't see money is gonna be a problem. The ace, the ace of earth. Yeah, but uh, of course, Capricorn is worried about the money. <clears throat> and not the relationship. Okay, you're going to have to put a little more passion into the relationship. Like I said, you need to go on dates. You need to. You need some long time, I'm hearing. Not so much as going on a date with your friends. All right? That way you'll change things. All right? Okay, both of you need to use your, your intuition too when it comes to your relationship. Because it's telling, it's, yeah, it's telling you how to get this balance, how to keep the faith within the relationship and not overthinking it. All right, the seven of things. The seven of things. Oh, look up seven, seven. Yeah, you have three sevens. This this feels good, feels good, but it's a little work. But this feels good. This feels like home. That's because this is your soulmate, period. So they want you, you guys to take a little hermit time, you know, togetherness time, okay? And have faith. And, and, and again, Scorpios, they saying not to worry about the money, okay? This month, you want to go with the flow, Capricorn, no overthinking. All right. Go with your intuition because it's, it's on target. Your money, you, you're not going to have to worry about because some kind of way you guys are going to find a way to get out of your money problems. Okay. All right. Let's see what this purple card is happening. Capricorns and Scorpio. All 
All right, let's start with the hearts. When it comes to matter of the heart, there's no right or wrong. Every choice you make expands your understanding of life and love. <laughs> Reflection. Give each other some space at the moment. Trust and have faith that all will work out for the best. Okay. Now, I'm focusing on myself right now. We're going to clarify that one. I'm going to, di I'm trying to distract myself from thinking of you. Scorpio. Now, I'm focusing on myself right now. Spirit saying you should be focusing on your relationship right now. Cre creating something there. Putting the passion back. Focusing on myself. Okay, yes. See, you need to be focusing on how to put, bring in that passion back, happiness and back into your relationship. Now, I'm hearing this is for Capricorn. This is for you. You should be focusing on your relationship right now. Yeah. How to get it to be restarted all over again. Bring in the back that I'm hearing that passion. That pa See, the passion. Okay. Don't worry so much about about um, work this month. Take a, a, a forward step in your love life. Now, Scorpio, I'm hearing this is you. You saying I'm I'm trying to distract because you you constantly thinking about your Capricorn. They saying to go go for it. What else do you have going to go for it? Yeah, see, because you, you really love them. You really love your person. So it's time for you. To, mm, see, look where it threw it over there by Capricorn's um, card. You know, this is your your soulmate. But for some reason, I, I feel like you, you're stopping yourself to go on forward. I keep hearing, do not worry about the money situation. Your money situation is about to change. You need to be concentrating on your love life with your Capricorn. Yeah. Now, some of you might want to get married. And if you're already married, it, your love just is going to get stronger. You're going to feel like, like a child love, like dreamy eye. I'm sorry. You're going to feel real dreamy eye. And if you're just meeting <clears throat> together, no, it might seem like it's going to be hard work, but you're going to find out through your, your intuition, this is a good relationship. Stop fighting it and go with the flow. Stop fighting it and go with the flow. One of you, see, because it feels so good. You know this, this is the right relationship for you. Yeah, listen to your intuition, go with it. It's a lot of passion. It's a lot of work, but they say you got this. Capricorn. You know how to balance this. Even when you guys are fighting, you know how to nurture the relationship. Capricorn, they saying don't overwork. Put the same time into your relationship. They want you to have fun. And again, no overthinking about bills. It's time to have fun. All right. Okay. Some of you, um, you have some ideas. Ideas that you, you, you're birthing right now, go with it. If you have some ideas of a business, 
okay? Or, or even getting into a partnership. I think you guys might even get in a partnership together. They saying not to think about it too hard. Yeah. Your intuition is telling you that investment will make you money. Okay. All right. Well, Capricorns and Scorpios, this is what I have for you. Do not forget to click that button on the right. I'm going to do this monthly, but the numbers got to be up. Okay. So the, 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 the viewing, so share or the likes are not there. I might have to stop this one. I don't want to. It was a good reading. Your intuition, please. That's what I have for you. Love you. Like, share, and subscribe. And I am Sin, the moon goddess. And I'm out, y'all.